hello dudes welcome to my channel so we are now going to see how to convert an image into a pencil art with the help of photoshop software let's go to the video this is the image which i have selected so let's start control plus j to duplicate this layer now go to the adjustment then hue or saturation just decrease the saturation to minus 100 now go to the layer 1 Ctrl plus I then change the mode to color dodge now go to filter blur then Gaussian blur just adjust the pixels As per your wish, you can adjust them. It depends upon the image. So I'm just adjusting to make it perfect. Yeah, this is okay. Now go to adjustment option. Select levels. Just make a slight adjustment. As you can see the image the variation now go to the adjustment again now select brightness or contrast just decrease the brightness as the brightness of this image is high so I'm reducing the brightness and increasing the contrast you can do as per your uh, image so which suits for your image uh, as like that you can make that just so this will be fine yeah I've done it now make a layer 2 uh, press ctrl shift alt press e to make the layer 2 so this is the combination of the below layers now right click and uh, just convert to smart object now we can go with the option filter then noise add noise i'm just going to adjust the amount as per my image
go to filter sharpen smart sharpen now we are going to make a small adjustment on the amount The sharpness of the image can be heated. So we have to give the proper amount. Which is our image. Now again press shift control alt plus E to get another layer. Then layer 3. Go to filter. Filter gallery. Here we are selecting the artistic option. Poster edges. Just make a slight adjustment as per your image. select the layer 3 and add mask to the layer now select the brush brush tool now we are going to remove the unwanted Things in the image. Keep the opacity and flow to 100% and uh, just remove the unwanted things. Now 
just select the background to white color and now we are going to add, add some black to the eyes and eyebrows if it suits well Now we have done this looks good now we just change the mode to either light or dark which suits your image well I think so my image is good with the uh, light and just see all the options how it looks we will just see Lighten is the best suit for my image. So this looks good. Now we just change the mode to either a light or dark which suits your image well I think so my image is good with the uh, light and just see all the options how it looks we we'll just see Lighten is the best suit for my image. So this looks good. Yeah, thank you guys. Just subscribe the channel and like if you like the video. Thank you so much. Bye bye.